What's up, y'all? It's Rashawn, Winfrey Fitness. I uh, meant to make this, no, excuse me, meant to make this video earlier, but uh, so I was in the gym today doing leg day, and uh, all, I mean, I've always been told, you know, once you lower your carbs, um, you're going to lose some strength. And I'm like, man, that ain't going to happen to me. I'm going to keep my strength. Nope. I'm down to 175 grams of carbs, and this is my second week doing that. And man, my strength, it went down a little bit. I mean, cause I, I was getting tired, man. So, you know, just know that when you do lower your carbs, you're definitely gonna lose some strength, but uh, just keep on pushing. And uh, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna keep on pushing through, um, lift what I can. Um, I'm usually doing a uh, high volume. I don't really do heavy weight. I do moderate weight, but uh, you know, the weight that I'm used to doing, like one example, I'll do uh, barbell uh, lunges. I put the bar behind me and I come down and I do my lunges. And I uh, usually, I was able to hit, you know, like 225 on that. But uh, man, that just felt too heavy today. And I just had to, you know, put leave my ego at the door and uh, put that down. So um, just went down and, you know, got a better stretch. But the cool thing about uh, doing lighter weight than what you're usually doing, you can really focus on, um, um, what the word am I looking for? You can really focus on uh, your form. And that's gonna be most important anyways. And I find like when I'm able to go down and wait, I try to focus really heavy on my form and make it as perfect as possible. So if you do have to do that for whatever reason, if you're doing lighter weight just because, really focus on muscle contraction. Focus on, you know, the stretch. Well, that's the squeeze. But like if you're doing like a uh, any type of like a press or a dumbbell press, um, incline press, dumbbells, whatever, you're coming something like that's just an example. But, um, you know what I'm saying, stretch and concentrate on the squeeze. You know, I think that's definitely helped me out um, with, um, you know, once I go up in higher weight, I feel like it makes it uh, not as hard for me because I've already practiced that with a lot of weight, um, really concentrating on my form. And once my body gets used to a certain form, I do that and I... Um, and I have the better chance of not injuring myself when I'm dealing with a heavier weight. Um, so yeah, that's all I was, just kind of wanted to say about that. Uh, my carbs are lower, so I definitely can see a difference now doing 175 grams of carbs and my strength going down a little bit. But like I said, I'm gonna keep on pushing. I'm gonna push as much as I can for 12 reps. I usually do four sets of everything I do. Sometimes I get crazy and I like doing five or six sets. Uh, still 12, moderate weight. Um, that's all I really had. Also, sometimes, and some of you guys will look at me if you start working out with me or whatever, but uh, I'll be in the gym and I'll just be, I'll stop and just stare. And it looked like I'm really thinking, like, you know, getting in the zone, but really I'm just trying to decide if I want to fart or not. For real. I think, like, is it going to be too loud? Can I get away with it? Or should I just hold it? So that's it. Uh, hope you guys like this video. Um, I hope you take that into account. Not the farting part. <laughs> I'm not lying about that either. That's true. But uh, you know what I'm saying? Like if you're going with lighter weight, concentrate on your form. Because that's uh, most important. It, it's stupid just to be throwing weight around and you're not really working anything. So concentrate concentrate on the stretch and squeeze. And uh, yeah, that's it.